The tugboat, for its size, is the most powerful craft afloat. And the star tugs are the power behind the docks and waterways that make up the big city port. This is Tugs. The 1920s. Big City Port was the biggest harbour in the world. It was a time of change and great opportunity. Nobody knew it better than the hard-working tugs, whose strength and big hearts made them popular with everybody from tramp steamers to ocean liners. Important jobs in the port often kept them working night and day. My tugs, the Starfleet, were no exception. I had three harbour tugs, OJ, a paddle steamer, Warrior and Big Mac. A railway tug, top hat. One little switcher, <laughs> 10 cents. And Hercules, my ocean going tug. They were a good crew, striving to be the best in the port. Not always succeeding, but proud of their work. I remember the day we got our first big break. It started like most, at dawn. Good morning, Starfleet. Today I've chartered another switcher to help out with the extra work. He's from upriver. Ten cents, he'll be working with you. Show him the ropes. Right, Captain Star. Here, what's his name? Sunshine. Sunshine? Only good for day work, is he? Might brighten you up a bit, Top Hat. <laughs> I resent that. Settle down. Give Sunshine a chance. Now for the really good news. After a lot of hard bargaining, it looks like I've managed to land the Ocean Liner contract for one of the biggest liners around. The Duchess. When she arrives this afternoon, the Starfleet will bring her into dock. But first, we've got to prove ourselves. OJ, you're in charge. Aye, aye, sir. Big Mac? Sir. You're leading. Right. Top hat, warrior, Sorry. you're on the side push. Not you, Ten Cents. This is no work for switch All right. Yeah, that's right. Big tugs only, Ten Cents. Make sure you don't bump into a warrior. On your way, <laughs> Ten Cents. Show Sunshine how to get the work done and fast. Yeah, right. OK, then, Now, sir. the rest of you. I want you all finished early so you can get yourselves looking spick and span for the Duchess oh. this afternoon. Our biggest rival in those days was Captain Zero. With his Z-Stacks, he was always looking for ways to get further ahead. Now listen to me and listen good. The Starfleet are about to get the Ocean Liner contract. Oh, it's and I'm not happy. We're not smiling, Captain Zero. I'm glad you don't find it funny, Zoran. Now I want that contract and you're going to get it for me. Oh, yes, sir, yes, sir, yeah. But how? I thought that... I don't expect you to think. Oh. You're a team, the best. Better looking, more powerful, and dare I say, more devious. I like that bit about better looking. Yes, but what's devious? What's devious is what's necessary to make an honest living in these days of corruption and bad business ethics. Oh. Now fire up your boilers and get that Duchess contract. There's no time to lose. No problem. That bunch of clapped out sardine cans are going to find a Mr. Boat, or my name's not Zoran. <laughs> <laughs> but it is Zoran, isn't it? <laughs> In the morning, Hercules had an important contract up the coast. So I was to lose his great strength on the very day I was to need it most. Well, Hercules, the Duchess is coming this afternoon. It's a pity you won't be there. I know. I really hate to disappoint the Duchess. Yeah, I'm looking for a switcher called Sunshine. You ain't seen him. Afraid not, old darling. Yeah. Well, he'd better show soon. I've a lot of work to do before this afternoon. I'll be back tonight. Oh, and ten cents. Look after the Duchess for me, won't you? Ten cents? Has that switcher found you yet? No, not yet. 
Carl is looking for you. Oh, I better go look for him. Watch in future. <coughs> I was uh, I was looking for ten cents, uh, sir. Yeah, well you just found him. Oh, I'm sunshine, sir. That's good to meet you. Come on, let's get to work. The Starfleet's docking an ocean liner this afternoon, and if we get a move on, we'll be finished in time to watch. Yes, sir. Now, now look, sunshine. You only call a captain star, sir. I'm just ten cents, okay? Yes. Uh, sure thing. Ten cents. Well, look what the tie's brought in. Izzy Gomez. <laughs> hey, you guys, I need a toe. We don't accept bananas as payment. <laughs> hey, big shots, you towing the Dutchess or something? Well, what do you know about it, you South American eater of junk? What I know, I sit around waiting for nobody to tow me. The hey. Dutchess, she come in this morning, suddenly everybody busy. But Dutchess isn't due this afternoon. Shut up, dingy brain. Come on. <laughs> I gotta get a tone and unload these bananas. You sure about this? Seen it with my own eyes. <laughs> yeah, we both seen it. Couldn't be better. Now I want that contract and you are going to get it for me. Yes, sir. This was Lucky's yard, where all the harbor's boat repairs were made. Next to it was the seaplane hangar. One of the Star Tug's jobs was supplying fuel for Sally. Hello, Ten Cents. Who's your new friend? Sunshine, meet Sally. She's our seaplane. Hello, S -s -s Sally. Thanks for the fuel, fellas. Yeah, we can't wait around, though, Sally. This afternoon, the Duchess is coming in. If we finish early, we can watch. OK. Bye, fellas. Yeah, all right, see you then. Yeah, wait up. What are those Z-Stacks up to? No good, I'll bet. Now, listen. Hercules is up the coast, out of the way. Big Mac is the strongest star left. If we knuckle him, we'll grab the liner contract. Yeah, I know, but he's bigger than... He's towing barges, dummy. His route is close to the mud banks, OK? Yeah, so? So, you stuff him onto one. OK? Stupid? You've done it before to yourself, Zip, so you should soon catch on. Yeah, I'll catch on, Zorn. You'd better. Do it fast and get back fast. Now, get... Devious, man. Hey, where your old friend? I need a toll. No time to argue about fees today, is he? When do I argue, compadre? He's a hundred dollar. Yeah, yeah, okay. But fast, we're bringing in Duchess this afternoon, and I need time to get ship shape. Hey, but my friend, the Duchess, she already here. Oh, she can't be. See, I heard her already. Suffering stacks. She's early. Got to tell the others. Sorry, Izzy. I'll tell you later. But, compadre... Mm. Zip and Zug knew exactly where to find Big Mac. They were waiting for him. Need a hand, Big Mac, old buddy? Well, guys, I... <laughs> well, it was a nice day, Big Mac. Thought we'd try to, you know, spread a little happiness. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like helping our mates. Can't go past and see one struggle. Thanks, guys. No, we'll be back in good time for the Duchess. Big Mac had no idea the Zed Stacks were laying a trap for him. Ten cents, have you seen Big Mac? No, is there a problem? The Duchess is due in early. We need him to bring her in. Uh, no. No, I ain't seen him since the briefing. Well, you two, go and look for him. The rest of us will have to try and manage till he gets mm. there. Come on, lads. Uh, the Duchess isn't going to like this. No. To your soon top hat. This ain't gonna be an easy one. Yes, where is he? We'll never manage without Big Mac. I'm worried about this. We we'll need help to docker. Come on, Big Mac. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Big Mac, it what's happened? I'm not sure. Zip and Zug were giving me a hand. The next thing I knew, I was on the sandbank. They went for help. 
Nah, no, they didn't. They're crooks, those two. Come on, let's get you out of here. There's no time. That's the Duchess. She's at the pier. You go and take over from me. OJ will tell you what to do. But I've never done anything like this. You can do it. Get going. Oh, We've got to show the Duchess the stuff the Starfleet's made of. Yeah, right. The Starfleet were doing their best without Big Mac. And for a while, it looked as though they were going to make it. But Zoran was still waiting for another chance. Uh, looks like your plan didn't work, Zoran. Mm. <laughs> if I can only get rid of that switch of sunshine. Thinking devious, eh, Zoran? No, just thinking contract. Look, they've slowed her right back. As the tricky part of the docking operation started, Zoran watched closely. Sunshine and Ten Cents were working hard at their new job when OJ ordered Sunshine to ease back. This is where we win the contract. Zoran saw his chance. When he thought no one was looking, he moved hard on Sunshine. Whoa! Sunshine hey! went into the rudder of the big liner. Say, so what's going on? She's out of control. Off. Oh, I've got her, OJ. The unimaginable had happened. The Starfleet had had to accept help from the Z-Stacks. <laughs> oh, so that's devious. Nice one, Zoran. Well done, Zoran. Glad to be of service. <laughs> Ashamed and confused, Sunshine couldn't explain what had happened. So he slipped away while the star tugs were still busy. He didn't know the sleepy tramper Izzy had been watching the whole incident. Nobody's ever going to talk to me again. Well, well, well. I congratulate you two. Oh, thank, thank you, you sir. sir. <laughs> Good man, Zoran. Right attitude. Oh, yes. One thing, uh, no one saw you, did they? Not even little uh, what's-his-name. Oh, Sunshine? No, sir. No one saw us. Good. That's very good. I'll offer our services to the Duchess Lines tomorrow. <laughs> Poor little sunshine. Just wasn't his day. <laughs> no, it wasn't, was it? <laughs> hey, I think what you are forgetting me. What am I going to do with these bananas? Oh, warrior. Hello, Ten Cent. Yeah, maybe I should go and try and find sunshine. What do you mean? What for? Come on, Top Hat. We all make mistakes. He must be feeling terrible. Well, so he should after all the trouble he caused. Hey, what do you say, OJ? Ah, it's up to you. Now, nah, well, <laughs> don't wait up. <laughs> there he goes. Always playing Mr. Nice Guy. What a bore. Oh, I can't see much. Sunshine! Sunshine! I'll never live this down. Just when I really had a chance. Oh, who's gonna want me now? Sunshine! Ten cents? Oh, no. He'll never forgive me. Sunshine! Sunshine, where are you? Sunshine! I don't want to talk to you. Are you there? It's so hard to see. Sunshine! Lily, maybe he's out there. Maybe I should just try and go home. <laughs> There's not much point in stopping here. Hi, Ten Cents. Ah, Ten Cents. Lily, oh, Hercules. 
Oh, thank goodness you're back. Yes, only just. Uh, why, what's the problem, old chap? Everything went all right with the Duchess, I hope. And why shouldn't it? Oh, uh, everything was just fine. Uh, she talked, and uh, everything. No, I was uh, just looking for sunshine. I thought you might be seeing him. Why, no. Oh, oh well. <laughs> well, see ya. Bye, Ten Cents. I've just got to get home somehow. Why, this folks thick. I can't get me bearings. I just... I don't know which way. I wonder where Sunshine went. Oh, it's well creepy and chilly out here tonight. Yeah, hey, what's that? Who's there? Oh, is it? It's you. Mm, in about time too. Why you promised me a doll? Oh, well, I've got to find Sunshine. Why? What's the matter? Uh, he disappeared. Well, I suppose he's ashamed after causing the accident with the Duchess. Sunshine didn't cause no accident. I saw it. Zora and pushed him. What? You sure? As sure as I know, I got a load of bananas and I need a doll. Yeah, I had a feeling those Zed stacks were up to something. Hey, wait a minute. I must tell the others. Hey, what about my doll? Come on, boy, wake up! Wait, what? Listen, Izzy told me he saw everything. What? Sleepy, is he? What did he see? Well, he saw the accident. I mean, he saw why Sunshine had the accident. Well, so what? He had it, and that's enough. But it was Zoran who hit Sunshine. That's what made him lose control. Izzy saw it. Oh, I wondered why Zoran appeared so quickly. You're right, Ten Cents. Izzy could have seen everything. He did. Look, you just gotta believe him. Sunshine isn't a clumsy tug. I can tell by working with him. All right, all right. Now, you've looked everywhere for him, have you, Ten Cents? Yeah, everywhere. He's as far out as Lily. Hmm. Well, if I was Sunshine, I guess I would have tried to make it home. That's it. Yeah, of course, that's it, up river. Yeah, come on. Now, the rest of you follow Ten Cents. I'll stay here and tell Captain Star. Poor old Sunshine, we done him wrong. I'm with you, Ten Cents. Come on, warrior. Top hat. And well as I'm doing nothing better. Yeah, let's go. It's as well Ten Cents and the others set out to look for Sunshine. He'd been holed and was in danger of sinking. Oh, hey, not the lad. Yeah, you guys. Look, I found him. Yeah, what a mess. We're gonna need a crane. Uh, uh, it doesn't matter, really. Just leave us alone. I've caused enough trouble. <coughs> Uh, matter of fact, we found out it wasn't your fault. So everything's all right now. <laughs> eh? An apology from Top Hat? I don't believe it. Do you think Captain Stard have us back? Yeah, I'm sure he will. Izzy told me everything. Suffering stacks. Izzy, I completely forgot. So it turns out you were seen. Impossible. I made sure. Don't argue with me. You were seen. Now the Duchess knows what you did to me. Don't get the contract. What kind of idiots do I have working for me? Really devious. Shut it, Zip. Uh, sorry about that, sir. Uh, uh, sorry. Yeah, sorry, Captain Zero. Sorry. Sorry! Sorry! I don't want to hear! Get out of my sight, all of you! A few days ago, we salvaged the tugboat Sunshine, and he was taken to Lucky's yard, and I'm glad to tell you that little damage was done. Oh, As for the yeah, Starfleet, right. we've learned a valuable lesson here. Yes, a lesson about have. trust and friendship. I think we have ten cents to thank for that. Yeah, and for the rest of us, about jumping to conclusions before knowing the truth. Yeah, now, I know you're all proud of being Star Tugs, but yeah, the most yeah, yeah. important thing in my fleet after hard work, is that my tugs always be true, honest, and forgiving. Why yeah, now, if you'll look to port, I would like you to welcome our new recruit. Here he is. Sunshine, I am proud to have you on my fleet. Welcome aboard. You look great, Sunshine. Thanks, kidder. Only new colours, eh? 